Fox40's Rowena Shaddix is in North Sacramento with everything that we know so far. Well, Nikki and Eric, we do know that two people are dead as a result of this shooting. I want to take you to the field that is behind me. We have been seeing lots of CSI people and also detectives going through this field. Now, this is what we learned just from the last half hour. There is an eyewitness or a woman who says that she is an eyewitness to this shooting. She explained to me that she cannot talk to us on camera right now. She's basically being sequestered to her front yard by police until the detectives are able to speak with her. But what she did share with me is that the shooting, she says, took place in a nearby apartment complex that is right next to the field. She said she heard the shooting and then a man ran outside chasing another man. And that's when the other shooting took place. She said she saw the man get shot in the field and then the gunman take off. So police right now, that is the information uh, that this witness was able to share with me. But police shared some minimal information with us about an hour ago. Take a listen to what the sergeant had to say. Um, our officers responded to the scene and actually located two shooting victims, uh, both males. Uh, both those males were actually transported to area hospitals and both of those males are actually deceased, unfortunately, from their injuries. Sergeant, can you tell me, we heard on scene earlier that it may have been a fight. The person that was losing the fight left, came back, got a gun and did the shooting. Yeah, I don't know. I can't confirm that right now. I know that there's different stories that our investigators are going to be working through right now, but I don't have any, any information like that to confirm that right now. And the sergeant also tells us that they don't believe that the gunman is in the area. They are, of course, searching for him. We have seen homicide detectives going door to door. They are looking for any kind of witnesses or people who may know some information about this shooting. But from the scene, that is the very latest. Reporting in Sacramento, covering local news that matters, Rowena Shaddix, Fox 40 News.